aware of the deficiency in this country a couple of years ago. And I myself went to my doctor and got a vitamin D test. And she said to me, well, I'm sure that you're going to be low. I haven't tested anyone yet that isn't low. And I said, really, well, why is that? And she said, I don't know. And I said, you don't know? And she said, well, I have a theory. And I said, well, what's your theory? She said, well, since I'm testing everybody in New Mexico and we're at such a high elevation, my theory is that it has something to do with the elevation. And I said, really? That didn't make any sense to me. I just thought, really? That's my doctor? Huh. I think I'm going to have to do the research myself. So I got my blood test from her. And yes, indeed, I was low. And that was four years ago. So I started to do the research about vitamin D. Only to find out that it became more and more interesting the deeper I got into it. And it was only most recently, in the last year, that I actually found the answer to why we are low in vitamin D. And I'm going to let him serve these real quick. So.